Okay, few more points. So probably the eyes. So oh, that look like the eyes in the back, but here in the front, I can clearly see that. Okay, so almost done here. Just I think few more. We'll also apply after after on this something else. So don't worry if you miss something. Uh, we use the C CS5 feature or CS6. If you don't have CS5 or CS6 Photoshop, uh, you will not have it here. <coughs> but still, uh, you don't need it so much. But uh, I will use the masking here and the smart radius on that, probably just to catch up some details. Okay, so everything is selected. Now let's go to path, make selection. We just make a selection of that and apply the mask. So it will automatically edit the mask. To our hippo, and when we are on the mask, uh, I will just copy this layer. Maybe we'll need it in the past or future. I oh, don't know what I'm saying. Uh, okay, so let's select the mask. Let's go here to the mask, mask edge, smart radios, and decontamination colors. So we'll slightly move that, maybe just one zero point one pixel, because it will also do some nice things. Uh, we also smooth a bit the edges and just hit OK. <coughs> uh, OK, so we can delete the old one with the new one. Now if you want, uh, if you think you need, we can still scale this a bit. Probably we, we should. So to make the head bigger to the body. <coughs> I think this will be better. Keep the position somewhere here. <coughs> okay, just press enter. We have here a hippo and we can proceed with the image. So I will make also a copy of the lizard. Just placing it down again. And now, uh, even with the head right now placing here, uh, here's, uh, here's still the old head of the lizard we need to disappear. So, uh, here is not so much, but here is a lot. Uh, so, we can turn this off if you want, and using a uh, clone brush. Clone tool. Uh, we'll try to delete that. Now, don't make much difference how much uh, or how it will look at the end because it's hidden by the head, like in these areas. So, if you do something like ugly there, don't worry because nobody will see what is behind. The only thing what counts is that the areas around the hippo, which are visible, will be clean. So we'll try to do it like that. So as you can see, on the top, the lizard disappeared and the background is still the same like it was before. <coughs> and this was the easier part. It was a bit harder here with the mount of the lizard uh, because it's slightly bigger. And it's always harder to make disappear things which are bigger. Okay, first I will use just this brush here. I know it looks a bit ugly. Looks a lot ugly <coughs> now, uh, but the highlights and shadows are more or less the same like those before. And now I will try the healing brush to 
fade away the things which I made, the ugly things. Still I need to be very careful with that because uh, 